The Department of Alcoholic Beverage Services is going digital. It's a move that could save Utah business owners hours. Fox 13 News reporter Lucy Nelson shows us what it was like to apply for a liquor license before and what it looks like now. Physically mail it through a courier service or drive it to the office. As general manager, Kay Campbell used to drive four hours all the way up from Flanagan's Resort in Spa near Zion to Salt Lake City for what he says was a complicated process of renewing liquor licenses. It would literally take several days to gather the documentation and make sure that you had all of the applications filled out correctly, um, pages and pages. Business owners and managers physically printing out documents, filling them out and either driving or mailing the paper and cash or checks to the Department of Alcoholic Beverage Services. Campbell says it was old fashioned and nerve wracking. We would send the payment, uh, physical money orders and when you are running a restaurant that's that's selling millions of dollars a year, your permit for serving alcohol is, is critical. Now the stressful hard copy days and long commutes to this Salt Lake City office are over. The Department of Alcoholic Beverage Services announcing its launch of a new online system. Governor Spencer Cox also saying Thursday it's long overdue. We're only about 20 years too late, um, but better better now than, than later. Executive Director of the Department Tiffany Clayson says these are just some of the boxes of applications submitted by the more than 4,000 restaurants, bars, hotels, gas stations, and other businesses. Now applications will be all in one place on the digital system. A huge milestone in these customers being able to interact with us digitally, which is going to save them, in some cases, hours of time. Um, it'll reduce error. She says she understands even in this day and age, technology may not be the easiest option for some. Anyone that has difficulty using technology or maybe doesn't have um, a, a reliable resource to use technology, all they have to do is call us here at the office and we'll make sure that we make ourselves available to accommodate that need. For Campbell, he says this is one of the biggest updates he's seen in his 20 years of working with the department. The, the changes in the last two years have been more so than the prior 18. Uh, it's, it's a substantial savings in paper and time. In Salt Lake City, Lucy Nelson, Fox 13 News, Utah.